Yo, what is going on, everybody? It's Conventico bringing you guys some more 2007 old school RuneScape, and this is another episode of my versus series. For this video, we are going to be discussing which is better for making money, green or blue dragons. And the first thing we are going to be discussing is the green dragon. So, as you can see right here, I have my inventory set up, which contains a teleport to house tab, so I can use my walled amulet of glory. But if you don't have a walled amulet of glory, you can just use a charged amulet of glory. I also have a uh, super potion set up with a regular defense potion and a looting bag so I can store more um, dragon hides and bones which is really helpful so if you don't have a looting bag you can get them from pretty much any monster in the wilderness. I prefer to get them from the thieves that are just northeast of Edgeville right here and I only have about 10 lobsters but you may need more if you're lower than level 115 which is my level and I also have this black dehyde to protect me against any PKers that might be trying to kill me so as you can see on screen here we have some tips to avoid these PKers the first thing is only risk about 150k at max and most PKers are going to be able to kill you at around level 90 to 100. So it is best if you are, I'd say, over level 100, say my level 115. But um, even if you are lower level, this is still a good money making method. The next thing is to use Black Dragon Hide, like I mentioned earlier, to prevent against getting frozen. Because if you get tele blocked and then you're frozen, then you're pretty much screwed and you're gonna die. So um, usually when people try to PK you, they'll come in teams and they'll teleblock you and if you see a team coming up on you then the best thing you can do is attack a dragon to buy you some time and then uh, teleport out if you have a tab. But if you do not have that then what you can do is either move south if they are a uh, high level difference between you and them and if you can't do that then move east to where the skeletons are so that way the skeletons will interrupt them and another thing you can do is always save at least like 20 to 40 prayer and some food when you're nearing the end of your trip and when you die make sure you return so you can get your looting bag your skill cape or any other untradeable items that you may have lost so as you can see right here I'm just teleporting to my house I'm gonna pray at my altar because you can use like piety or whatever to make your trips go a little faster and then I just rub my amulet of glory and go back to Edgeville to bank so now for the blue dragons for my gear setup you can um, bring your best gear that you have because you won't have to worry about dying and here's my inventory setup I have a way to teleport back to the Falador bank a potion setup a special attack weapon and about 10 lobsters and that's pretty much it for my gear setup now we're going to be looking at our path to getting there and as you can see um, I am using a shortcut that requires 70 agility and if you don't have 70 agility then no doubt green dragons are probably better for you because not using this agility shortcut makes it like I'd say three minutes in order to just get there and without it probably only one maybe even more than three minutes I don't really know but um, basically if you're not using this 70 agility shortcut then it's not really worth it so as you can see I'm hitting a lot more zeros against these blue dragons and it really adds up so if you're going to kill these blue dragons then you might want to use piety and um, I have an altar and Falador teleport at my house so that's why I use my house teleport tabs which helps out a lot so now that I've gotten the guide portion out of this video for killing both green and blue dragons we're going to look at the statistics comparing the two to tell which gives us more money per uh, the amount of time we put into it so for blue dragons I get 12 kills per trip which is 42k total per trip um, with the dragon bones being 1.7k and the hides being 1.8k which is 433 seconds per trip and this equals 350k per hour for myself now we're looking at green dragon so it is 26 kills per trip because I have the looting bag which um, gives us 85.8k total per trip with the dragon bones being 1.7k and the hides being 1.6k currently at the moment it takes 652 seconds to complete a trip 
which equals 474k per hour for myself and if you're a lower level then you're not going to be getting this much money and if you're a higher level then you're probably going to be getting more money per hour so this means that you get 74% more money by killing green dragons than blue dragons without the risk of getting PK'd. And even if you were to get PK'd that often, um, you're still going to be probably making more money with green dragons. So hope you guys found this video helpful for your money making in the future. If you enjoyed this video, then please leave a thumbs up. And if you want to see more like this, then please subscribe. Put a lot of effort into making this. So please leave some feedback and I'll see you guys later in my next video if you are subscribed. Peace.